Hello. <laughs> um, so this is what I wore to school today. It is homecoming week and today was messy. Monday. Messy Monday. So we got Monday out the way already this week. It has been a very busy week last week. <laughs> I've been staying after school almost every single day helping kids do this big gigantic homecoming board thing where they decorate the board with the school's mascot and there's like a whole theme and all that kind of stuff. <sighs> It's fun for the kids, but I'm excited that it's finally done. <laughs> and we get to spend the week having a fun homecoming outfit. So stay tuned to see tomorrow's outfit for homecoming week. Woo! But now I am going to relax <laughs> for the rest of this Monday. Let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> I have got my afternoon snack. I've got my afternoon beverage. I have my afternoon candle that you already saw. And now I have my afternoon activity. I have not gotten to play much Sims 4 this past week, so now I am taking a full advantage of this energy to play a video game. <laughs> and I think that I'm also going to watch a film a film. I think I'm also going to watch a movie on Netflix. This one right here, How to Deal with Heartbreak. I don't know. I just saw this pop up yesterday and I like myself a romantic comedy. Um, so here we go. Play. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Let this cozy, relaxing Monday night play out. I think that maybe it'll rain. It looks kind of dreary outside as you saw in one of the previous clips and I am here for it. <laughs> I'm only like two minutes into this movie and it's already like so cute. Why? <laughs> it's one of those movies that's dubbed. You can totally tell, but it's still really cute, so. <laughs> so you mean it? Outfit number two for homecoming week. <laughs> Can you guess what I am? <laughs> I am Cat in the Hat. Day number two of homecoming week was rhyme without a reason. And I didn't know, but I did it wrong. <laughs> so I was supposed to have like a friend. I was supposed to dress up as something that rhymed with my friend's outfit. For example, I saw one really good one. A boy dressed up as a chef and then his friend dressed up as a ref, like a referee. <laughs> and I thought that was cute. I, I like I like the chef hat, so. But um, yeah though, I don't really have that many art teacher buddies that I see every day because a lot of the arts department is all scattered around. And my classroom is actually in a hallway all to itself. That's just how the layout is. I don't really get to talk to the art people that much. And they did send an email. One of them sent an email yesterday like, what should we dress up as? But I had already ordered this and I didn't realize that um, we were supposed to have like a twin to rhyme with, but whatever. I was my own rhyming twin today because it works. Cat in a hat, that works. Tomorrow's dress up day, I am so excited for. I get to wear a wig, I get to wear a wig. <laughs> you will see that in just a little bit. But first, we need to walk this animal. Darby do? Ready for your walkies? Ready for walkies? <laughs> we need to go for a walk. Oh my goodness, he just jumped on my back. What the? But I am not wearing this out on the walk. No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's change <laughs> and go for a walk.
Okay, y'all. It is day three of homecoming week. Day three of spirit to wear for homecoming week. Can you guess <laughs> what I am dressed as today? Also, my favorite outfit of the week so far. Here she is. <laughs> complete with a cat hat. Today was Senior Citizens Day and I was so excited for this day because I got to wear this glorious wig. I wore this once last year at school whenever, oh hello girl. I wore this wig once last year at school whenever I dressed up as a witch for Halloween, which I'm gonna do again this year, so I'm really excited about that. And tomorrow's day is actually gonna be another wig wearing day for me. So I'm very excited about tomorrow. Here is my outfit, here's my OOTD. I've got this beautiful little cat hat that I crocheted myself and and I've got this wig, this really cool scarf. I do not crochet this, but I love it. And just like this, I don't know, kind of just kind of house dress <laughs> and a big old sweater. I completed this gorgeous ensemble <laughs> with these shoes that I always put on to go walk the Darby Doobie and some pink socks. So. Tell me what you think about this ensemble for Senior Citizens Day. I got these glasses, but I actually wanted to wear a different pair. Let me grab them. <laughs> I wanted to wear these glasses, but I forgot them at home. The other glasses were in my car. I don't know, which ones, which ones look better with my outfit though? I don't know. Maybe the other ones actually ended up looking better. Oh, and my mother, my dear mother, gave me this gorgeous little crystal necklace for Christmas one year. I feel like whenever I'm old, I'm totally gonna be a witchy cat lady. I feel like I already am. That's how I feel in my soul. That's how I've always felt in my soul, like a witchy cat lady. That'd be cool. <laughs> Amy Hoosies. Tonight, I think I might clean my floors. <laughs> I'm gonna film myself cleaning my floors just for motivation. No, I'm not gonna wear this outfit while I clean the floors. <laughs> Although that would look kind of cute. But no, I am, I'm, I'm, I'm hot. I need to take this sweater off. I need to go walk this animal. <laughs> he is so ready to go walkies. <laughs> Let's go do all of our things and then relax for the rest of the day. done vacuuming so I'm just gonna relax have some tea and read a book Shirt. All right, who can guess who I am from my shirt? Because this is a shirt that I have been wanting ever since the very first Harry Potter movie came out. I am Ron Weasley. I love my outfit today. And this hair is just looking so fun for me. <laughs> yeah, so this hair is so fun. I actually really like the color on me. My mom, she says I should wear this wig every single day. <laughs> What do y'all think? So the reason that I'm dressed up as Ron Weasley is because the theme for today's homecoming weekday was ABC day. So we had to dress as something that starts with our 
our first name. And my first name is Rachel. So I dressed as Ron Weasley and I've always wanted this sweater actually. It's from the very first movie during the Christmas scene when Ron gets this beautiful knitted sweater from his mom and Mrs. Weasley also knits one for Harry. And it's super special because it makes Harry feel like he's part of the family because he's like, oh my gosh, I got presents. I got presents. British accent. I've got presents. I've got presents. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's why I'm dressed as Ron Weasley, yes. <laughs> It seems like this generation of teens don't know Harry Potter as much as me and all my friends loved Harry Potter as whenever whenever I was growing up. Not that many of my students knew who I was. I mean, my hair is longer than Ron Weasley's hair, but I was not about to cut this beautiful wig. All right, I'm not about to cut it. I guess Harry Potter's just not as popular as it was whenever I was a teen. Like me and all my friends reread and reread all the books together. We watched the movies together. They were coming out. That's probably why. The movies have been coming out since I was, I think, in kindergarten. One every year or every two years would come out after I was in kindergarten. So anyway, I love Harry Potter. Who else? <laughs> Lots of people of course. I will link this sweater below. This sweater was actually made in the same facility as the actual sweaters that were made in the movies. Let me get the little card. I have a little card, okay? Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, I'm sure you're here. So <laughs> this sweater was actually made, here's a little tag. <laughs> <laughs> Harry Potter memorabilia. This garment is knitted and assembled in the Scottish mill that made the costumes for the cast and extras in the iconic Harry Potter film series. So I thought that was a really cool. It's made in Scotland. It's not even that itchy or scratchy. I feel like I thought I thought it was going to be more scratchy because it's wool. Yeah, I'll link it. I'll link it below. Thank you for listening to that. But yes, for the rest of the day, I am just going to cook. Enjoy that footage. <laughs> Ow, <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, coming to you from my kitchen, I actually did end up getting that Blue Apron meal kit. I have gotten Blue Apron a whole bunch before. Uh, look at my subscriber count. I, I am not sponsored. <laughs> I like getting Blue Apron just because there are a lot of interesting ingredients. My favorite thing that I've ever gotten had these little guys in it. Little sweet drop peppers. Is that what they're called? Sweetie drop peppers. They're a questionable website and I planted a whole plant. <laughs> I'm going to cook the pork roast and balsamic shallot pan sauce. <laughs> Let's cook y'all. I'm hungry. gonna go outside and like make a whole like thingy thing but the sun has gone down and I'm hungry and this fork has goat cheese on it and I love goat cheese so let's go ahead and try this you know what I'm just gonna chop it with a knife that I have been chopping with this whole night because I don't like to waste things I don't like to waste silverware and stuff what is what am I eating again? Pork roast and balsamic shallot pan sauce. Oh my god. I'm listening to a podcast. Y'all, it's been a time to be alive. 
This is really good. This is so good. Oh my gosh. I haven't had a blue apron meal in forever. I kind of singed the pork roast, but whatever. I don't cook meat very often because I don't eat meat very often, but I do like pork. So yeah, this is good. Good night. Stay tuned for tomorrow's homecoming outfit. Okay, bye. <laughs> Darby's excited about my outfit. <laughs> um, yeah, today is Friday and it was the last day of homecoming week. The outfit was supposed to be like a blackout day just for like our mascot is all black. So I wore these really cool flared pants that I actually thrifted. I thrifted these pants for $23 and I looked them up online and it was a really good brand and I found them for around $200 online. <laughs> so it was a score. There is something on the back like that looks like, I don't know, the person before me. Maybe they sat in some kind of a glue thing, but whatever. <laughs> And this shirt is from Amazon. I will link it below. Yeah, I've just got some little boots on. I'm kind of feeling a little 90s or early 2000s with these little boots. I feel like Mia Thermopolis in Princess Diaries when her grandma is like, I don't ever want to see those boots again. And then they show her like clicking her little boots together like. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. <laughs> All I'm gonna do for the rest of the day is watch Bachelor in Paradise because it came on last night. That me and my mom, we usually watch Bachelor together, but my parents are out seeing Guns N' Roses or they're coming back from that trip, so we didn't get to see it together. <laughs> We're gonna watch Golden Bachelor together though, but she gave me special permission to watch Bachelor in Paradise by myself. So that is on the agenda for the rest of the night. I just, I picked up a make it your own pizza from one of those make it your own pizza places <laughs> that's close to me and that is it. Thank you so much for watching this vlog, especially if you made it this far in. It was a very fun vlog to make. I feel like we did so much stuff this week, <laughs> but yeah. It's time to watch Bachelor in Paradise, eat some pizza, and chillax and start a new weekend and a new week. Thank you for watching. See y'all later. Subscribe for more videos like this. Bye.